In this episode, I'm going to give you a going gray update. Yes, there is gray hair here. And I'm also going to share with you about my new project, YOLO with CK. Stay tuned. It's so hard to believe that it's been two years almost since this channel was first launched. And my very first video for this channel was about me going gray and starting the going gray journey. And at that time I was like six weeks in and there was really bad lighting in that video and people couldn't see my grays. Frankly, I couldn't see my grays. Um, so in this video, I thought I would do a two year sort of update on my going gray process. There is gray hair here. And um, I first off though want to uh, touch upon some trailers you might have seen roll out on this channel recently uh, for the channel YOLO with CK. Uh, YOLO stands for You Only Live Once and it's with Carol and Kendra, me being the Carol. And um, that is really turned into sort of my fun channel, my DIY channel with law of attraction, yoga mixed in and what have you. And um, I encourage you to check out some of the videos if you haven't seen them. They are so fun and I would love it if you head over there and subscribe and check out the videos. Um, the video launched this week is a very funny look at Kegels and us doing them on dates, uh, singing karaoke, uh, doing a business presentation, etc. So head on over there and uh, check out my other channel. Uh, that other channel does not mean I'm not going to continue with this channel. I definitely will continue with this channel. Uh, when I initially started the Carol Borelli channel a couple years ago, I wanted to have sort of a fun lifestyle quality to the channel, but it's really turned into primarily a color analysis channel due to demand and I totally get it. And so I feel a need to um, establish some videos on that sort of fun law of attraction front and hence why that other channel has been created. So again, I would love it if you head over there and check out the YOLO with CK channel. I'll put a link on your screen and in the description below and subscribe and like the videos. Um, so now on to the going gray update. Uh, so there is gray hair here. Look at that. Uh, so it's almost like highlights in my hair. And uh, when I initially started off this process, it was much shorter and I've decided recently to grow my hair a, a bit longer. I'm not sure how long at this point, uh, but I must say I love Love, love, love having my hair natural and um, it's so fun. I think the gray highlights look fantastic. And um, in terms of like the stereotypes about, ooh, gray hair makes you look older, blah, blah, blah. I, I think that's uh, silly and I'm gonna be bluntly honest with you. I have a 21 and a half year old son and uh, even with my gray hairs, when I tell people I have a 21 and a half year old son, people are shocked. And so, um, you know, I don't think the gray hair is making me look older. Uh, I feel fantastic with it. Um, I, in the last two years, have entered a very serious romantic relationship and uh, didn't impact sort of my dating life or what have you, has not impacted my business or anything. And uh, ultimately going gray is a personal decision. And, you know, color analysis aside and what have you, meaning is gray in your hair color palette or what have you, it's truly about feeling fantastic, feeling fantastic about yourself. And, um, you know, if you choose to color your hair or not, um, ultimately your personal style is your personal style and have fun with it. Um, because we only have this one life and uh, be who you want to be internally and externally. Uh, so that is my going gray update. I do insert some fun colors in my hair because I like a little splash of fun in my hair and why not then these colors are in my color palette. Um, comment below let me know about your going gray journey and uh, what have you. Uh, let us know if your journey is fun, what you're experiencing. Uh, start a conversation about going gray. 
I hope this video has inspired you to sparkle today.